I'm not exaggerating. I met some dime pieces when I was in the Philippines. So many girls that look so good that thought they were ugly because each culture has its own view of what is attractive. I used to say to myself, if you're ugly, then I like ugly. And they were so feminine and showed you so much attention and care. They would make you fall in love in the blink of an eye. And I've never seen so many amazing shapes in my entire life until I got to the Philippines. Because, you know, in the U.S., these women, they think they look good, but they're overweight and out of shape. In the Philippines, I've seen girls who were considered average in their culture who had supermodel bodies. And if you brought that same girl to the United States or your country, someone would try to steal her from you because she looked so good. I met a girl one time from one of those small islands that wasn't that populated, and I brought her to the city. She looked so good. When I took her to the mall, the Filipino guys were trying to go behind my back and talk to her. She was so fine. I said to myself, man, I got to keep her in the house. She looked that good. I met one girl there. She had more booty than a pirate. One time she was at my house, and one of my married friends called me on Skype, and he happened to see her in the background in the video chat. He said, who's that? So I introduced him to her, and he looked at me and gave me a little sly smile because he already knew what time it was. By the time that me and the girl parted ways, she had almost broke my heart, and she had me hooked. She would come to my house and get comfortable and walk around and cook and clean and help me relieve stress, if you know what I mean. She had me wrapped around her finger. Those women, they know the art of love and romance. They love to love. Don't go over there vulnerable and unprepared because you're going to find one girl and she's going to turn you out and you're not going to know what to do with yourself. So with all that being said, I don't know about you, but I'm excited for the Philippines to be opened up again so I can have some more life-changing experiences. On a side note, we're in the middle of launching PanayMatchmaker.com, our very own dating website. For Black Skull listeners and those who want to sign up, instead of spending money on Filipino Cupid or some of these other websites who don't monitor their members, who don't care about scammers, take those dollars and sign up for a month, three months, a year, and we'll use those monies to go towards marketing to build a better product. When I say quality product, I mean good customer service, quality women on the site. And if you report a scammer, we'll investigate it and remove them. So sign up now. We're going to be fully launched by the end of December. PanayMatchmaker.com.